hi guys welcome to my youtube channel in today's video i just want to just with you guys really i just want to just about the topic 10 real estate companies in lagos that you must know 2021 so earlier this year someone asked me abiola what are the top real estate companies in lagos and i felt hmm i think i should write a blog post on that and that was what i did um i wrote the this blog early in the year i think about in the first quarter even though it wasn't published on my website until later and i just felt let me let me let me just throw this topic with you guys and in this video you would know why i have these 10 companies on this list and this is my own personal opinion my own personal list and valid as a 2021 okay so if you're watching these videos years later this video this particular one you're watching right now was shot in 2021 okay and yes so that is it and these 10 companies were listed in no particular order okay i just listed them and i had to um i came up with this list based on what i've seen in the industry over time you know companies that have stood the test of time that have you know um based on what they've done in time past how they've delivered to clients delivered on promises integrity innovation and the good thing is that this list is not just it's not just filled with companies that uh that only um provide real estate services or development to the high income class alone so this list cut across companies offering premium real estate and those that are also offering real estate for the middle income earners and the low income earners right so it's for me it's good stuff but most importantly companies that you know have stood the test of time integrity that brought innovation into the game integrity into the game and because i've been in this industry for quite some time for years actually over five years i know almost all the real estate companies in lagos i've partnered with com with some couple of them and even those that i've not part partnered with i know most of them i know their strengths i know their weaknesses so when i talk to clients and clients let me know what they need i know the company to refer them to that would help them achieve the goal they want to okay so over the years i've seen companies i've even uh, i've seen companies that have, you know that were startups and they didn't even last two years three years so i've watched the trend i've watched the flow over the years and i came up with this list so this is my own personal list as of 2021 and through this video i said i'm just here to just see you guys i'll let you know why i have each company on this list and now this doesn't mean that it's only 10 companies that are doing good in lagos i have more than 10 companies i partner with way more than just the ones on this list and even for some on this list i don't know partner with them but i'm just being truthful with you on um you know i try to come up with a list that is more biased okay so whether i partner with them or not is based on what they've done over the years what i've seen standing the test of time bringing innovation and change um game changing development into the market and delivering on promises to clients okay so that is it and yes there are some companies that are not on this list that are doing great as well but i didn't want it to be more than 10 because i didn't want to bore you guys out like let's just leave it at 10. so there are companies in Le other companies in lagos to doing great stuff delivering on promises but yes i just restricted this list to 10. so that is it so i would scroll through now and i will let you know why each company appears on this list for me. So my name is Abiola Fadansi. I'm a real estate consultant and broker here in Lagos, Nigeria. As a consultant, one of the things I do is educate you on real estate do and don'ts so you don't get your fingers burnt. And as a broker, I help investors locate genuine properties at the right place, price, and terms so they can make maximum returns on their real estate investment within the shortest time possible. So if this is your first time of watching a video on my channel or you are yet to subscribe, please do that now. Subscribe to this channel. Like this video as well. It doesn't bite. Okay, so please subscribe so you don't miss out on any of my educative videos that I'll share with you. And yes, so this is my website. So I'll just be scrolling through my website. My website is abiolafadaunce.com. I have a lot of good stuff and content there. So you can check that out, out as, as well. Okay, so... The first um, real estate company on this list is 
One, Landway. And I told you this list is in no particular order, okay? So for me, Landway made this list because Landway is first, Landway is, in December 2021, Landway will be four years old. And for me, it's because I've seen Landway grow from a company which started their real estate um. Um, which which started owning real estate from far away in Bejeleki. They started with, a, the f name of the first estate was Eden. I think Eden View now, I'm not sure, but Eden something in the Bejeleki after La Campagne Tropicana. That was where Landway had their first, very first estate, you know, with land sales. I think then even so for about 700,000 years. And Landway, I, I watched Landway grow from that company that had one property in Bejeleki, and they came all the way out to Shongote do with Westwood. Yes, Westwood, which sold for five million at that time. Westwood now land in that area sells now for over twenty million, by the way. And that was this less than four years ago. Okay, and I've I watched Landway grow into a formidable brand, into a brand that came into the industry and disrupted the market in different different ways with innovation, technology. Landway for me made this list because um landway is a forward thinking brand right and is 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 a very disruptive brand it got into the industry and changed the narrative landway came at a time where yes the real estate market was flooded with you know different real estate companies but they changed the game they came with developments that are you know designs development well after they got into building like Landway's developments stand out. There's no way you would drive through a development by Landway and you won't you won't turn to take a second look. There is no way. So even when you have clients that are going on inspection to other properties, they get to see this project and they're like, this is owned by Wood. This is owned by World Company. And the fact that they've been able to keep their promises to clients over the years, yes, they've had their challenges over the years, but the good thing is as a company, they were able to pull through those challenges, okay? And that's, um, for me, Landway made this list because I've watched the growth over the years of Landway. I've watched out from a company with um, one particular development in the Bejuleki, selling lands in the Bejuleki, move further out, and now Landway is dominating the Abraham, um, uh, Abraham Adesanya axis of Lagos with the Obam Prime project, Obam Prime 1, 2, 3, 3NS, Obam Prime 4, and delivering on quality houses in less than 24 months like that's good stuff so landway made this list landway is a company that delivers on promises so for me yes they deserve to be on the top list for real estate companies in lagos so that is it landway is a growth company forward-thinking company and most of their developments actually are meant for the middle income earners and the high income earners anyways most of their de developments are kind of premium but yes, quality, when you're thinking quality, you're thinking good, um, good stuff, development. And now Landway is moving. Okay, so now currently Landway has what's the first wellness um, city in Nigeria. And I think it's it's the second, the second of its type in Africa. Yes, the second of its type in Africa. And they are having that in Ekpe, all the way in Ekpe having a wellness city which is called Isimi. Isimi means rest, rest in Yoruba. That's what it means, where it's away from the hustle and bustle of the Lagos kind of life, or even the Nigeria kind of life, where you can have rest with no pollution, no generators allowed. And anyways, I'm not here to market their property. But yes, doing great stuff, very forward-thinking company, you know, changing the narrative, disrupting the market, like Landway does something and you are still wild and before you know it, they're on to the next one. Like it's hard to catch up for those that are competing with them. It's hard to catch up. So that's it. So Landway made this list for me. That's why they are on this list. So number two is Realty Point. So Realty Point is, I think um, it's over 15 years now. And why Realty Point made this list for me is because over the years, they've been able to stand the test of time. And Realty Point is a company that focuses more on the, you know, on development for the low income earners and the middle income earners. And it's good because these are the kind of companies that don't leave out, you know, they make it very possible for everyone, even though you're a salary earner, um, um, even though you don't earn so much to own real estate, right? 
you can invest in real estate due to the flexible payment plans they've laid for as, as much as up to 24 month payment, um, installment payments and as low as even you paying daily if you want to for those that end daily. You know, at first, when I got to know about all these daily payments, when I was like, how will these things even work out? Some people get tired. When I mean tired, like maybe it's just some companies just do that because they think some people won't be able to follow through over the years and um, keep up with the payments. So at the end of the day, they don't keep up, they get nothing. But you know, I had to study this method, which um, Realty Point use, and it's good stuff because, you know, it's just a way to you, uh, make those that don't have everything like the box on to invest in real estate still be able to invest in real estate so for realty point for me over the years they've been doing great stuff filling that gap filling that gap for the low income earners very flexible payment i have here realty point is one of the companies out there that are stood the test of time in terms of quality service and integrity yes integrity is key integrity is key when it comes to the real estate business you know delivering on your promises as well no matter the um, cater of the society you are serving in your in your in your in your offerings, okay. As far as I'm concerned, realty points are stood the test of time and trust. Most properties are realty points are not that expensive. They are very affordable, and in addition, they have some sumptuous payment plans that can span as long as 24 months, and they deal in real estate that is available to the af average Nigerian on fair terms. So, so good, good stuff. So if you're someone that you feel, well, I don't have a lot of money, but I really want to invest in real estate, Realty Point is, is, is your go-to company, right? And the deal in real estate is available to Nigeria on fair terms. The unique selling point for Realty Point is the affordable properties and their flexible payment plan that can even accommodate daily payments, okay? So for Realty Point, they are serving the needs of the lower and the middle class. And they also make a viable choice for those who receive payments on a daily basis from their business. So, yes, Realty Point has stood the test of time. Integrity, quality service. You don't have so much and you really want to invest in real estate, you can think about Realty Point. So, for me, they made this list because, like I said, I told you earlier, this is a mix of different companies offering different levels in the society. It's not just companies that offer premium products alone. Had to balance it. Then number three is Trumville Limited. One of the things that stands out for me for Trumville as well is their integrity over the years, especially you know having a team that understands um um and and they understand the core value on, on, of the company and the and, and they stick with it. Okay, so for Trumville to also is integrity and they have moderate pricing as well. So but for Trumville they don't have so much flexible payment plan. Um, as much as Realty Points have, but Trump View to offers um, products for the middle class and the average Nigerian. P properties very affordable. They keep to their promises. They have properties on the mainland, on the highland, on the island in Bajuleki, on the mainland, Mowe or Fada. They have in Ogun State, Mowe or Fada, Badagri, and so on. I think um, um, Realty Points also have properties in Badagri. And areas that yes, you you can eat that are affordable and they have really, really flexible payment plans as well. Okay. And their target, okay, so just like Realty Point, their target, their target locations and properties, the target locations and properties that the average Nigerian can afford within a reasonable period of time. Okay, so Trumville to make this list, they've stood the test of time, they offer services to the average Nigerian, the middle class, because one of the goals, one of the MD of um, Trumpville, his name is Dikin Adeyemi Adeni, and he is the, he's also known as the Bishop of Real Estate. One of his goals is that for every Nigerian to own property. So this goal makes them stick to properties that the average man can afford, and they have flexible payment plans as well. Like I said, so it's it's good stuff. It's good to know that there are companies who still put the um, average income earners, who still put them in mind, who still put the middle class in mind, and make sure and uh, give them flexible options in which they can own real estate and have roof over their own heads as well. So for Gracious Global, Gracious Global for me, okay, yeah, you, you see I'm smiling. Gracious Global, I've watched Gracious Global 
global limited grow as well just like landway from their first office in a quarter shopping complex all the way to a bigger office in the quarter all the way to the permanent site where they are now and the company is also coming up with another office somewhere in Shongotedo. and for me what stands out is the integrity of the md right i've watched the md is mrs dr mrs ololade abuta and over the years i've seen um promises being kept to clients i've seen promises being made and even in situations that you know for me i admire the md so much because If you are not told, you won't even know that the MD is a woman. You will think it's the way the company is being run, the way promises are being delivered, the way um, developments keep running. You would think it's it's actually a man that is behind all of that, but it's a woman. That's to show you women too are doing great stuff. And it's true that what a man can do, a woman can do way better. Tell everyone I said so. <laughs> okay, so Glashan is an illustrious company and secure. Um, Secures themselves properties more on the Lagos Island. So, Grashes focus more on the Lagos Island. Landway to focus on the Lagos Highland. But, um, Tromville and Realty Point focuses on mainland and on the highland, okay? So, however, they still do much in creating a form of flexibility that allows people from the upper class at least to own properties on the highland. So, um, Grashes focuses on the highland, but over time, they had, um, um, before now, they had properties that even yes, they had, they had properties that even the the low um, the average income earner could invest in. But now, Grashas is going more into development and coming out further into the major part of Lake like Shongote Do, um, um, Shongote Do Abraham and Desonya Axis with their Grashas Goshenite and all the development. But for me, to Grashas is a company with integrity, right, and that keeps to promises as well. And they have really, really cool pricing, fair pricing in the market that you can take advantage of. Okay, so one of the major reasons I recommend and respect Gracias is the integrity of their CEO, Ololade Abuta, who has been able to instill that level of integrity in the company itself. Mrs. Ololade moves everyone and earth to make good on her promises, and that is commendable in this industry. Yeah, if it has been said, it will be done. If it has been promised, it will get done. That is it. Gracious Limited. And yes, for me, they made this list because there's nothing like delivering on your promises to clients. I've seen a lot of companies promise everyone and her just to get clients money, but they don't deliver on their promises. After the money is in their hands, like there's nothing you can tell them. They now become the Lord, but that's not the same with Gracious. Promises are kept. Promises are delivered. Okay. So that is then number five, Metro and Castle Limited. So for Metro and Castle, Metro and Castle was a company that caught my attention when a client wanted a particular property and I went um, out looking for the property. But I just saw this company that has a lot going, a lot going on around the Ajiwe Ibrahim Adesanya um, axis. And so I, I, I got to find out about the company and their development around the axis is very, very commendable, clean development, like clean development, good development, and over time I got to know that their first project, I, over seventy percent, I think, was bought by famous um, Nigerian footballer, and their development offer like very safe space, secured, calm areas. They are more into they are into buildings, not land sales. So buildings of terraces, duplexes around the Abramadiswa and Lagos access and that level of around that area, that level of organization like really, really caught my attention. So I wrote it that it's undeniable that Metro and Castle Limited is one of the top real estate companies doing wonders around the Abramadiswa. Their packaging and creative delivery are almost unmatched in that axis. This is because their properties stand out with features such as daily minimum 18 hours of electricity that gives them an edge in the market. They have functional structures and track records to prove themselves as a top dog and are doing just that. I put them on this list of top real estate companies in Lagos because I love what they are doing and I think it's bold, unique, and quite innovative. Yes, it's quite innovative around that area. Doing and yeah, people are living there, no complaints. Very neat spaces, very neat area. They are dominating the axis and it's, it's, it's good stuff. Yeah. Good stuff, really. So number six is Veritasi Limited. And just like Landway, I've watched Veritasi grow. Yes, 
just like land where I'm watching Veritasi grow and what Veritasi is doing is very, very commendable, you know, forward thinking brand as well, started from land sales in the Bejileke houses, then moved to Shongote Do with Kamba, no, um, yeah, Cab Cambridge or something, yeah, in Shongote Do, then Kamba Wall in, Ikat in Abijo. Yes, Abidjo moved into from land sales to development of houses with the first one, which is Kamba Wall in Abidjo, which was sold out. Then Kamba Wall Court Phase 2 is currently ongoing. Then Kamba Wall Advantage in Ikate, like the bold move, the bold move from Ibejileki to Shongote Do to Abidjo to Ikate. And now I think they are coming up with something in Ikoyi, and that's, that's good stuff. Delivering on promises as well. Especially in the development, um, in the development area, they are doing good stuff as well. And yes, Kamba Wall Advantage, Ikate first one is sold. I think it's first two that is currently selling. And you know the speed of work is quite commendable. So for Veritas to have watched them over the years, they stood the test of time. So I wrote here this beautiful film, Meritas is still quite young, about three years old now, yeah, no, up to four, and are doing great, growing smoothly and delivering on their promises. They started with land sales and have gradually moved to also cover development. They've made the bold claim of providing marketing, advisory, and developmental services. Meritas does this across the entire real estate value chain in Nigeria and across Africa, yeah. So very tasty to commendable. They made this list for me. Then number seven, Red Brick International Limited. You may not know Red Brick, but I'm sure you would have you're familiar with Amen Estate. So Red Brick International is the company that built Amen Estate, the popular Amen Estate that Funky Akidele, also known as Jennifer, is their brand ambassador, where she shoots most of her Jennifer diaries. Yes. So Amen Estate has been very popular for a long time. And for me, for many people, many people still wonder. What were they thinking, you know, before the whole Ibejileki, Dangote Free Trade Zone, um, Leki, um, Leki Deep Sea Port, um, Rave, the noise and all of that, Amen Estate has been there. And anyone will wonder why go that far? Why build such an edifice in that location that is like far from the world, so to speak? And the, the, the funny thing is that project is a very huge success, even till now. Like the focus on Amen Estate, 24 hours electricity, great light, and you wonder, and these properties are not cheap. But they, are, they keep selling out. They are not cheap. It's until recently, I think about two years ago, they come up with Amen Estate Phase 2, which is still currently selling, which is, of course, much more affordable compared to Amen Estate Phase 1 with both land sales and building, um, sales of buildings in Amen Estate Phase 2, which is much more affordable compared to Phase 1, but it still offers that same level of security. And most people trust them to buy from them because they've seen what they've done with Amen Estate Phase 1, which is like the premium. And there was a recent documentary that showed the, four, um, the top five most expensive estates to live in in Lagos. And Amen Estate made that list despite its location. And it's, it's, it's not a lie. It's one of the most expensive estates to live in in Lagos, Amen Estate. So Red Brick here is doing great stuff. Amen Estate Phase 2 is still selling, currently selling. Amen Estate Phase 1, yeah, I know some buildings are still selling in there, but it's not even, it's not open, it's not open to the masses. It's such that even before you see, before you take a client to see buildings in Amen Estate Phase 1, you have to pay. I think as of the last time I checked, okay, I don't think I, I should mention the fee, but yes, the security is that tight. No one is just permitted to enter, come in anyhow. If you want to go on, you would have to pay to get in. That's to show you are serious and not just a wanderer, wandering everywhere and anywhere. So Red Bricks doing great stuff. The company came into the limelight and became a formidable force with their Amen Estate project. The project boasts of hundreds of housing units with Funke Akidele as one of their top influencers. Amen Estate is not only popular, but has announced the ability and integrity of Red Brick to potential buyers and investors. And that's true because even most of the people buying Amen Estate Phase 2 are buying because of what they've seen happen with Phase 1. Like they've done well for themselves. So, number eight is Victoria Crest Home. Victoria Crest Home is another company that made this list based on what they've done keeping to promises, handing over keys for clients who have bought in the, into their project over time and doing good work. And the company belongs to uh, Mr. Ned Okonko and Mrs. Ichechi Okonko. 
right? So they also provide affordable housing solutions that exceed expectations with their flagship project, Victoria Crest Estate. One, two, three. Victoria Crest homes have shown their presence and dominance in the industry. They deal more with residential properties in the choice part of Lagos here. Yes. They don't exceed, uh, where's that their father's properties? I think around, I think it's Orchard Road. Orchard Road should be where they have, like, when coming from the main lake, I think Orchard Road, I don't think any of yeah development is further after Orchard Road. So they've dominated, they've done a lot on, um, around where we have Nikkei Art Gallery, that Ikate, around Ikate, done a whole lot of developments in choice areas of Lekki. And yes, they are delivering on their promises and it's good to see good stuff. The company is growing as well. So Fine and Country Nigeria. I have to put Nigeria because Fine and Country is not just in Nigeria alone. The company Fine and Country is an international real estate brand with over 300 offices across the world. They have a presence in South Africa, Dubai, Malta, Mauritius, and Thailand. Fine and Country exquisitely combine premium real estate development with consulting and they target premium clients. Yes, premium clients only, please. Premium clients only for Fine and Country, right? And they, they combine both development. Premium development and consulting, right? That this is a company that co that doesn't just develop the consult, um, they they add consulting to it as well. And one of the unique selling propositions for Finance Country is their international brand identity and exposure. Yes, so Finance Country just like okay, yeah, it's one of it offers services for premium clients only. Premium, just premium. And number ten is Suji Moto International. Owned by the popular Shujibomi Akidele, and find um, Sujimoto is known like okay, they've positioned themselves so well to be known as the king of luxury here in Lagos. So when you're thinking luxury, you're thinking where I where do I want to scatter and finish my money? Where I want this money I've made in this life, in this life that I've come like this, where do I want to enjoy it? Then you'll be thinking, um, uh, um. Sujimoto's project you'll be thinking is development, which has the like of Davido live in them okay so yes when you've arrived you finally bought all the lands everywhere you bought you've invested so much in real estate and now your money is paying you back or yes and you want to flex just go and buy a development from studio motto they offer luxury yes so if you're looking for high-end luxury real estate company this is the real deal over the past couple of years Studio Motor has come to establish itself as the top real estate company that offers the best to those who can afford premium. Like I said, if you think you have arrived. So they offer premium for people like me because, yes, I have arrived, okay? So they offer premium to those who can afford them. Class, classy luxury, luxury alone. Like they've positioned themselves as that brand that gives you the best when it comes to real estate. You want class, you want luxury then they got you like these guys. Yeah, so that is it. When it comes to brand perception, they want to be known as a real estate brand, um, real estate company for the cream de la cream of the society like me. And they have succeeded, yes, over the years. Sujimoto specializes in residential, commercial, and hospitality properties, mainly in the eyebrow neighborhoods of Ikoyi, Banana Highland, and Abuja. Though their prices are premium, like I said, Sujimoto gives you value for your money and delivers on their promise of almost unbeatable quality within a reasonable time frame. So that is it. You're thinking luxury, you're thinking class, you're thinking the baby girl lifestyle. Think Sujimoto, they got you covered, okay? But let your real estate investments be the ones to fund your luxury lifestyle. So if you've not invested in real estate or you don't have so much of, you don't have a large real estate portfolio and the first money you have, you want to buy a Sudibomi property. It's good. It's fine. I'll be here for you. I'll be here to put you through. <laughs> okay, so that is it on the top 10. And like I said, it's just because I don't want to overstretch this list or bore you out. There are other real estate companies doing great stuff in Lagos, Nigeria, but you just have to be careful. Do your due diligence on them before you invest with them. Check their track records. And for any of these real estate companies, if you need help with investing or purchasing a property through them, I can help you. You can reach out to me, yeah? I can help you, even help you negotiate as well, okay? So, yeah, I can do that for you. So, there are other companies doing great stuff as well. Here in Lagos, good stuff, but I don't want to make it more than 10. That's why I just talked to 10. 
Okay, so that's it. And here I have on my on my website, I have my free guide, which I share with people for free. Um, and the topic is um, five things to look out for before buying prop before investing in real estate here in Lagos. So you want to get that, just go on my website, you see this way, you fill in your details and it will be sent to your email. So that's it on this video. And I hope I've been able to let you know why each of those top companies are there and I've been able to just choose today. I didn't come serious. I just wanted to just for you guys. Okay. And yeah, so if you've not liked to subscribe, I really don't know what you're waiting for. Please do like this video, share it with someone, subscribe to my channel where I educate you on real estate, everything real estate. I, sh I explain real estate terms. I, um, Share short clips on Ask Real to Abdullah, frequent questions on being asked. And very soon, I'll start sharing my lifestyle with you. So other things aside, real estate from the other things I do, yes. I'll start vlogging, really, in the, in the real sense of it. Okay, so that's it today. And um, what have I not said? You can follow me on social media. You can follow me on Instagram, on LinkedIn, on Facebook. Yes. And if you want to send me a message, a personal message, I'll also put my WhatsApp link in the description of this video so you can send me or um a direct message on whatsapp but follow me on social media i'm active on instagram i'm active on facebook on linkedin and of course here on youtube channel that's why you should subscribe to this channel right away and yes mm -hmm, thank god i didn't forget every month i give out five free strategy session slots to real estate investors this is where i share with you for free in a phone conversation the exact blueprints that I've shared with hundreds of real estate investors and I've worked for them. So if you want to get on that free strategy session call with me, the link will be put in the description of this video as well. If you are lucky to be part of the first five in the month, it will pull through for you. So book that session with me as well. That's one of the ways in which I give back apart from all these free videos I share with you as well. So yes, if you're serious about investing, you need clarity on something, you don't know how to go about it, get on that call with me, book a session with me. I'll be glad to put you through and I'll be glad to share that um, blueprint with you. So that's it today and that's the end of today's video. Don't forget that I'm the real estate expert that educates you on real estate do and don't so you don't get your fingers burnt. And I'm the real estate broker that helps you invest in peace of mind and not just a piece of land. So if you need my service, I'm here for you. I got you. Just send a message and don't forget to subscribe. Right now, subscribe. Hit that subscription button and hit the notification bell so you are notified when I post videos. And what else? Share this video. Yes, share this video. And yeah, you'll be glad you did. Thank you and bye for now. That's it today. That's all today on today's video. Bye and take care of you.